hello and welcome back to Adam. We are exploring, uh, which is actually a nice change of pace from all the talking. We actually had a, a lot of talking uh, last episode before I just uh, managed to get here. And uh, wow. Uh, enter. I'll just go in, in there. I think I'm just gonna start skipping some conversation options at this point. Uh, if I'm just not having fun with that. <clears throat> so what is this place? Ooh, it's, it's small. Hmm. What? Okay. Because, uh, it, it, can, it can actually just get tiresome. <clears throat> In front of you stands a sturdy, bearded man. He quietly whistles uh, some old waltz melody and observes uh, thoughtfully the float on the water surface. He feels your presence and flinches. Oh, that's the guy. It's really hard to see. <clears throat> oh god, you scared me, little lady. What are you skulking like this for? This area is not safe. If I had a gun, I could have shot you. But I see you have no gun. No, I don't have a gun. Have you been following me? Smile <laughs> ominously. Uh, no, I just come in with the obvious. I see. Uh, makes sense. I'm just a bit nervous, is all. <clears throat> you see, at night, all sorts of rabble gather here. Bandits, they avoid this uh, quay during the day. But all at night, all hell breaks loose. What are these bandits that gather here? I feel not dance guys. In comparison, his men are like uh, the lambs of God. No, the folks you encounter here at uh, nighttime is much gloomer. Maniacs, cult followers, drug dealers, slave hunters, some creepy people. Yep, yeah, that's pretty bad. True, there are enough uh, gangsters around. Uh, yeah, I wouldn't complain if there were fewer of them, but these bastards are everywhere. Okay, um, this is called a transition period, don't worry. It'll all le level out soon. I'm just gonna shake my shoulders, what the hell. Ah, to hell with it. Let's change the subject. I don't really feel like talking about all the uh, this mess. It does nothing but depress me. That was the catch. Man, not really. I mean, the lake is is big, but there's not many fish. Probably because they dump all kinds of shit into the the Paragon. These businesses don't care if the local residents suffer. I see. Tell me about the Paragon. It's something like a fortress. Wait, what did I say? About this Paragon. That, that's what I said. <clears throat> it's something like a fortress the merchants founded on the northern shore of the lake. Caravans from the north, the east and the west stay there. Some to rest, some to drift uh, down on rafts safer than road. There are plenty of highwaymen now. Okay. A few questions? I don't know. Like, the thing is, if I start asking him questions, a lot of these questions are gonna be generic as hell and we're just never gonna get anywhere, I feel like. Tell me about yourself, buddy. And he, they just talk so much. I feel like all of them want to tell you their life story. And people are not like this. I, I want to see some people who tell me to fuck off. And they just tell me like a half sentence and just th that's it. <clears throat> oh, what is there to talk about, little lady? Once I was sailing the local rivers on the tug Ivan Tups Tupit Sim. It dated back to way before the revolution even bore the name. Of a Volga merchant who used to own it. Ah, this thug survived the revolution and two wars, but this third one finished him off. Such a pity. 
Or do you, have you heard something interesting? My friends who have a TV set from uh, Resno told me about the beast they saw in the program. It's called Toad Ghoul or something like that. A mutant can disguise itself as a human being and then criticize and plot against City Trade Council. Yeah, I have to go. Uh, good luck with the fishing. It's not so great, but I guess this is something. Is it the one? Is it the thing we came for? I don't know. I don't want to miss anything in the game, or miss anything that really matters in the game, but damn. Some of these chats are running long. <clears throat> anyway, so. Uh, no, 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 no. Go there. So this is where we have to go to do the mission from the abandoned factory. Uh, we can consider going to Bunker 317. Maybe. Uh, Radnoya. Hmm, I'm not sure if we can do anything here. I can always check the quest log. Krasno. Good question. I mean, we might want to find the bunker. I kind of want to find the bunker. Let's let's find the bunker. Can I be anything but uh like a little henchman of the bandits? If I can, I want to do that. Uh, I I've, I've been uh. Ambushed by uh, the member of some murderous doomsday cult. If you won't do anything, they will surely attack you. I can talk to, try to talk my way out. Failure. It's a fight. I need to get better in fights. Apparently, you can get companions in this game, uh, which would be really fucking nice. Uh, some dudes. Yeah, we gotta run over here. So I might be able to. Get some hits on her. <clears throat> I'm radiated. I can actually get some uh, points on my melee weapons mid fight, but do I want to do that? Because I think we might want to do that because we're really struggling. Really struggling. Martial arts is close, but I think we need some kind of uh, way to fight. What if I up this to like 80? 99. So at this point, I can actually aim. I'm just gonna up it even further just to see what happens. So I can start aiming at heads and whatnot. Critical damage in the head. Oh, she's not feeling well. But do I want to like such a heavy investment in melee? I think that might be a good idea. Should run away in a way. Now that's too risky. And this could be risky. Like, oh no, this is bad. I can hit, hit in the head. Yeah, I just get slashed to pieces. That's so bad. I don't have enough HP. <clears throat> but if I want to 
get better at fighting, this is the only way, right? I have lower strength because of that. I'm radiated. Not sure how to fix that. Well, we probably need to get some kind of red away, but we don't have that. Wait, what? I'm so good at aiming? Really? I'm, I'm really good at aiming? Or maybe just... So this is the aim shot. What if I... Aim him the head. Oh, it's jammed? What the fuck? <clears throat> this is this is savage. They just ripped me apart, and this is normal. <clears throat> Let's see. I'm just testing the damage of this thing. So apparently the damage is okay. That's not the problem. But the problem is the availability of the ammo. So I may not want to invest in melee. If I can... Um, get good with uh, pistols. If actually I had more action points, that would be so much better. Because I could run away like six tiles over here and shoot two. Which would be epic. But I don't have that many action points. So I'm not sure what to do. Because I get into fights all the time, and the only thing that I can possibly do is just try to run away. But that's kind of silly. Pistols and SMGs. And if I try to do some kind of a, a melee style, that doesn't work so well. Oh. Putting out... Yeah, putting out the, my pistol was, was a bad idea. So we got punch. We can just check our options. But I'm pretty sure that's just not, not gonna work. What? I didn't even click on anything. Oh yeah. Uh, actually, I forgot. That if you want... Uh, this is a thing from Fallout, actually. That if you want kicks... Uh, you actually have to... Uh, well... Uh... Free up your second slot. So we have the basic kick. But that's just like three to four. That's that's not good enough. That's a three and a half uh, damage here on average. This is like a five damage on average, plus allows us to do aim shots. So this would be okay if it dealt more damage. But it it, it doesn't. <clears throat> I just don't really wanna invest in in, in just... Wait, how are we doing? In melee. Just so. 9 mil. 30 caliber. Do we have 30 caliber? Yeah, that's 30. So I have 7 plus 5. That's all. I can try shooting people in the head. It basically is the same damage. It has the same damage. As uh, as the knife, but it's ranged. It has a chance to jam, and of course, it needs to be reloaded. <clears throat> but that's basically it. Single aimed, and that, that's it. I, I suppose it takes uh, four action points to reload. This is just so conflicting. Uh, by, by the way, I didn't say go next. <clears throat> we might just have to run away here. Uh, because what? Why did I lose action points? Game. Okay. I think we just gotta run away. I mean, that that's the only thing that makes sense here. And, and we're gonna prepare for the next fight. Wow. Okay, that that was bad. Can I just come over here and, and try to get something, buy something that, that gives me any advantage? Because I need I need anything. Anything I can get. Anything I can get. We need it. Oh my god. Is there a way to pick up a companion? We need a companion. <clears throat> Who can be a companion? Need some information. 
Yeah, I'm not not good. I'm also radiated and hungry. Can beat. Um, wait, no, no, no. It adds radiation but lowers hunger. This adds toxic. So that's not the best. <clears throat> Don't I have some canned food? Okay, maybe we are not eating the toilet paper. <laughs> but, come on. So, uh, we can check in with the dock. Wait, who the hell is he? Go get him! I don't even see this guy. <clears throat> you see a bearded man in police cap and old duster. On his uh, back sits an old travel bag. Judging by the sheets of uh, paper stuffed into the bag, this man is a real blithe postman. No way. Well, it seems like we are, we have totally new guys here. <clears> Hello <throat> oh, there, sweetheart. No mail for you, unfortunately. May I ask you some questions? What are you busy with? Well, as you can see, I deliver mail. Dangerous work these days, but some <clears throat> someone's got to do it. Who do you work for? The Trade Council of Krasno, the local government, in other words. Uh, their seat of power, as you can tell by their name, is in Krasno, though. They don't really rule around these parts. Mostly they just sell TVs at a low price to brainwash the locals with propaganda. <clears throat> That's all because they managed to repair the TV tower at the river. Don't think I'm too harsh on them, though. It's clear that they are basically thugs, but at least they're trying to become a real government. They even hired me to deliver mail, just like uh, in the olden days. So is there a lot of mail to deliver? You wouldn't believe it. I barely cope with the amounts. I'm always asking the bosses to hire s <coughs> more postmen, because all those people look at the idea of creating postal service suspiciously at first, they soon learn how uh, great it, it really is. So now I'm delivering heaps of documents, letters of inquiry, and even love letters all over the place. People really are social animals. So who do you work for? I already know that. <clears throat> yeah, whatever. Postman guy! Who would have thought? Work, work? Who are you? Aw, oh, <clears throat> the old woman. Do you have some good stuff? I really need it. Please tell me you have some good stuff. Protected face mask. Ah, oh, not really any good. He doesn't have anything good. A biscuit. A club. But it costs 4 AP to use. Meh. That's bad. I'm just looking around, okay? <clears throat> Is that the... Okay, I'll leave. Oh yeah, th that's the guy. It's it's really hard to tell who is who because, uh, uh, well, you can tell their, their, by their pictures, I guess. But you don't see the name over them. Stimulant. So, can you heal me up? Adok, I need your help. Thanks, Doc. Um, I want to buy some medicine, so how do we get rid of radiation? Minus radiation. One tank? Uh, is there any other way to get rid of radiation? Oh, crap. Oh, boy. That is stupidly expensive. I can't even buy bullets. What is this? And I can't hold my own against anybody. Alright, let's go. I need some companions, please help me. I feel like having a what? 
I don't even know this woman either, or do I? How's life out here? Who's this guy? I don't know. I don't know this guy either. <clears throat> Before you stands a tough, hard-looking uh, man aged around 45. He's wearing an old sunburned uh, shirt with short sleeves and uh, hardy work pants. It's not hard to note not to notice a wide black mustache on his strict face. I don't know, like, we can just go chat with all these people, but it doesn't seem like it leads us anywhere. We have the same four questions with everybody. How's life out here? It's okay living, heard in rumors, some cult in Krasno. Seems like it really doesn't matter. What about this woman? Do you want to come with me? I just came here to chat. May I ask you some questions? Oh, hello again. No nonsense, girl. Are you going to try to convince me to do something again? Oh, does she remember that? Maybe... Oh, who the hell is this guy? <clears throat> You see a muscular man near the bar. He eats uh, minced meat out of a can and washes it down with vodka. His face uh, looks familiar to you. Yes, of course. It's another atom cadet you knew before uh, being sent on a rescue mission after the last expedition. You never were friends, but you still recognize him. His name is Alex Alexander. Hey! The big guy turns to you, squinting a little. Finally, he waves to you. Hey there, babe. Didn't recognize you. The superstitious believe that it means you'll get rich. Uh, what are you doing here anyway? Alexander sniffs, uh, looks at the barkeep and the girl at one of the tables. He then whispers to you. <clears throat> oh, honey, come on. What am I doing here? Did you really think that you're the only one who was sent here to look for Morozov and his crew? No, it just that we were sent here at different times. First you, and a bit later me. I just stum stumbled upon this village myself. Do you wanna team up? How's the investigation going? <clears throat> so I'm making calculations, I analyze, I'm analyze. i analyzing data, almost found our lost guys. When I save them, I'm getting out of this place, cause well, just look at that guy over there. Sweet cheeks. Uh, check out this his meaty eyebrows. A real-life mutant is what he is. A monster shaped into human form. Most of uh, the villagers are like that. Ugly fellas, inbred and dumb. Thank God me and you, we have integrity. And we will never tell anyone the location of our secret organization. Great. <clears throat> I see. Can I ask something else? How is life in the way treating you, buddy? What are you, my mother? Don't answer that. I, I, I can see you're not here. Life is okay. Well, it's not like they say in my native Georgia. Sweet peach, but it's still okay. Okay. Fine. Let's ask something else. Uh, have you heard anything interesting? I start attending to my muscles as of late, doing some bodybuilding, you know. I doubt the shrimp, like you would find that interesting, though. <laughs> Fuck you. <sighs> yes, why do you need this? You, my friend, only think of the material aspect of life. You and I don't know each other well, but I'm almost sure that for you, this is just another means to an end. Knocking outdoors, scaring people, lifting heavy things that are required for the mission. But me, to me, you know, to me, strength is beauty. The hidden beauty that makes girls around you blush and drop their pants down. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Um, so, did you learn anything? How should I put it? Not long ago, I was walking through a forest. I might have had something to drink, just a little. What are you, a cop? Were you a cop before the war? Are you gonna send me to the clinic? 
No. Well, then listen carefully. So suddenly I hear, holy crap, what a cracker. A child is, carrying, a child is uh, crying in the woods. Wah, wah, it sounds so real, I, I swear to God. I kept on walking, of course. Obviously, it's some kind of new mutant that learned how to imitate a, a child's cry to lure people into a trap. Sure, <clears throat> of course. But even if it wasn't, I don't feel like dealing with babies. I'm not that guy. Maybe in another life, but not right now. And I advise you to do the same when you hear something like this, especially in an unpopulated area. That's it? That's all you learned? Fucking hell. Oh my god. So many NPCs. Talking to them is so fruitless. God damn it. I can't buy anything that's any good. Can I? Do you have ammo for your shotgun? Of course he doesn't. <clears throat> I'm just passing through. <clears throat> Banks for necklaces? Cheap price? Hey, do you have something to sell? Yeah, that's not terribly interesting. I need some bullets. He doesn't have bullets either. Nobody has anything. This is bullshit. I'm just passing through. I don't want to look into some guy like, how do you get a companion or how to get strong? I only have this bloody knife. And, well, I do have a pistol as well, but no bullets for it. Which kind of makes it kind of useless. Well, we do have some bullets, but it's not going to last us a long while. Alright, well, I just progress anyway. But I had to run away from some dumb cultists. That sucks. Let's go that way. Just to see what's gonna happen. Oh, we gotta eat. Pretty damn soon. Oh, can I just rest? Maybe that works. Can I rest? And, oh. I guess I can cook here. <clears throat> we can prepare... Um, Mama Liga. Let's cook it. Okay, I'm not hungry anymore. But I'm still ra irradiated. <clears throat> what about the herbal tea? Let's leave. Uh, these things help with radiation? Oh, we gotta check. Oh boy. Is there a way to limit this? It's not as obvious. Seems like it includes everything, no matter what. It doesn't say what it does. We got herbal mix and tea. Uh, make some chifir. Boil it. I lost tea. Oh, I took some damage? Oh my god, that's the worst. Okay. <clears throat> uh, there's not much we can do here, other than just leave. Actually, I need to roast some meat, right? Let's cook it. back. Well, this is pretty good. Okay, let's just continue. Leave. Uh, do I need to find that? Yeah, I need to find this. Bam. I just want to progress in the game. Okay, let's check out this bunker. If we can. Oh, can I go past? Well, oh, well that way. You've been ambushed by bandits. If you won't do anything, they will surely attack you. I can just talk my way out, right? Easy. I got some XP. But if they attack me, I'm just I'm just gonna die. <laughs> yeah. 
I guess that's that's how we're gonna do it. Oh fuck. Giant ants? Try to escape. Easy peasy. This is a good adventure. Just rolling the 40% chance and the 50% chance to not die. <clears throat> what about this bunker? Do I need some kind of protection to deal with this bunker? Meet the, meet the uh, junk scavengers. Why not? <clears throat> junk scavengers! What's up? Do you guys got stuff? Where are you? Oh. Oh. How friendly are they? Talk to the leader. This is what I like. So finally we got guys that just says, Fuck off, I don't have anything to say. I like this. Before you stands a man in pre-war jacket, sporting a gas mask. Hold, he holds on to the straps of his huge rucksack with one hand. Um, well, almost misread that rucksack to something else. While playing uh, with a rusty bolt in the other, his voice is distorted by the mask. Hello, darling. Want to buy something? Show me what you got. But this is nothing! Wait, what is this? Yeah, that's no good. This is nothing! Uh, heard anything you? Who are you people? The garbage collectors. I don't care about your story. Let, let's just go. So, uh, we we're very close to the bunker. At least they were friendly. That's nice. Okay, we gotta check out this bloody bunker. What? Oh, look at that, a proper helicopter! With a bunch of dead bodies. Hmm... Well, I guess we're gonna take that. Wires with electrical tape. Take it. Ooh, that's the one I have, right? Yeah. Damn. Getting bullets is just damn hard in this game. If I made a, a fighter character, then I would have at least, well, I think significantly more HP. Less, at least 20 more. I have more dodge, have a lot more accuracy, more action points. But I, I didn't foresee that it's gonna be that, this hard. Oh no. So, we got the ant, 73. We can try stabbing it. So this basically gives me just, uh... How much? 14%? It's like 15%-ish. Uh, extra chance to hit it. Can I just hit and move away? Does that work? Oh, what the fuck was that? Oh no, they're gonna swarm me and kill me. This is bad. Wait, why do I have less action points? I only have seven. Is it because of the radiation? 
That is correct. Is this a... Uh, is this place uh, not helping my radiation thingy? Wow, I don't know what to do here. Okay, I'm just gonna die here. That, that much is certain. I'm gonna die. I can't take on these ends. So that's not gonna work. I can try to get in the bunker. Not sure if that's gonna be easier. It's locked. I can't break the lock. So that's not gonna work. So we came, came here early. There's no way to do anything here. Uh, I can pick that up. Does it get... Is it gonna have the same solution as, uh, as in Fallout? You just ram this thing into the door? Inspect the boxes? Attention, these boxes are empty, probably looted even before the apocalypse. Their only contents are... Now are fallen leaves, dust and sand. But wait, you notice three shells lying on the bottom of one of the boxes. Take the ammo. Inspect the cart. Inspect the boxes. Inspect the control panel. Press buttons at random. The buttons can hardly be pressed because all the exposure the cart suffered over the years. Inspect the mechanism. <clears throat> the gadget uh, that you're looking for is clearly hidden behind the plate under the control panel. All bolts are rusty, but you might be able to Tear it off with a little use of force. We can try that. We failed. Let's try again. We can try to fix it. Before, you use a jumbled mess of gears, drums, springs, pistons, and levers. Every metallic surface is brown with heavy rust. However, the machinery itself looks repairable to someone of sufficient skill. We did it! Using your expert eye, you look over the mechanism. After a moment, you realize that the device is much less complicated than it seems, giving the central gear a push and returning the anchor fork uh, to its slot. You take a step back to admire the fruits of your labors. The cart mechanism is now ready to use. Press buttons at random. Inspect it. Inspect the car. Um, what do you mean ready to be used? Obviously it doesn't work. They're just giving me the same thing. Don't give me the same thing. I already see. It. I've already seen it. Oh. This is not working. Yeah, we can't do anything here, from what I can tell. I need to explore this bunker. But I'm pretty sure we can't do this uh, right now. Also, there's a decent possibility that I'm suffering lethal radiation uh, by hanging around here. So we probably have to pop back to the same town. I can check. Can I check? I should be able to check. Um, how can I check my uh, level of radiation? Ability tree, that's not gonna be it. Somehow, it was, I think it's inventory tab, yeah, yeah. So I got 500 radiation, which is significant. I think we should just fuck off. 
for now. And uh, we're not coming this way. We know one thing, one place uh, we can explore, for sure. I can't even fight the guys on the way. I just need to hope to uh, be able to run away. This is uh, not as good as I hoped. I'm really hoping for a companion. At least some mercenary guy. I got some money, I can pay you. You just join me and we... Uh, try to escape arachnids. How about that? We've done it. <laughs> it works. We are really good at running away from fights. If if somehow we could win this game by running away from fights, uh, even from the most basic fights, uh, we're definitely gonna win this game. Oh, it's some scabs. Okay, let's meet them. Like, it, it literally can't get any worse. So, uh, let's see what you guys got. I'm hungry, hungry. It looks like the same guy. What you guys got? Med kit? It fixes blindness? That's kind of lucky. But overall, this is just bad. I'll be on my way. Hmm. I wonder if I could actually have a companion by now. And I just didn't realize who could it be. I don't know. <laughs> I wanna go back. Get the anti rat serum. So I don't die. Because it's pretty bad right now. Poison. Yeah. I don't think radiation goes away. I'm also hungry. Trading caravan. Oh, uh, definitely do that. Please. Yeah, uh, hey caravaneer guy. Let's do, show me the stuff. So he has a free speechcraft helmet, which is actually very interesting. One survival, free survival. Can I just wear this helmet to make every further uh, trade more interesting? Uh, well, more profitable. Rubles. Potato. This is so bad. Do I want a flat cap? It's also gonna look dumb as hell. Doesn't it? I don't know what to sell. I guess I can just uh, give away my money. Coffee? Real coffee. Piece of tire. Uh, do I just need to put in my... Okay, let's do that. I'm gonna put in my money, if I can actually find my money. Done. Trade. Just passing through. Unfortunately, they couldn't help me much. That's gonna be a dumb looking helmet, isn't it? Yeah. I look French now. Like, super French. Holy crap. I'm gonna take that revolver to my head. It's time to end it. It doesn't have anything else. Wait, what? Aren't I supposed to have like a crazy amount of personality now? That's the whole point. I. Oh fuck, free speechcraft? That's not worth it. I'm done. Don't I have a safe here? I don't care about free speechcraft. Free speechcraft. I need that 100 caps. Yeah, we're not gonna buy anything here. This is this is terrible. Wait, what is that? Is that a way out? Or just some secret cave? Oh, don't tell me we're gonna get even more irradiated. Can't take that. Oh, 
Well, some guy died from the radiation. Let's just check out this place. Just some random crap. I really need to get back into crafting. Uh, because who knows? Maybe I can use the, uh, the crossbow. If I can use the crossbow as a way to... I don't know. Just use guns. Not melee. Just use guns. Oh, we are poisoned. Of course we are. It's locked. Unlock it. Oh, we did it. That's great. Ah, uh, just take it all. Looks like for the most part we're just finding stuff that has no value on its own, but we might be able to use it for crafting. Ultimately, I'm kind of happy that we got in here. But it's time to leave. This is one of those games where you just... Well, well, basically it's called uh, where the fuck do I go uh, type of game. But also, like, talking to people is not definitely uh, always fun, so... And I just, I just need help. Like, the, the, the game is so damn hard. I don't know where to go. I'm poisoned, radiated, encumbered, and hungry. I'm, like, critically hungry. That's not good. Can I just... Do a camp? <laughs> Before I go to the a city? Oh no. I can't do that. I can only go to the city. Cuff, cuff. I'm really good. Doctor, please help me. So, I am... I could be better. I have to, I have to be honest. I could be a little bit better. <laughs> Dog! You gotta help me. I gotta buy the... The serum. Just to get rid of the radiation. But I, I don't even know. Uh, I, I guess that's that's a it's, it's good or bad depending on uh, what you think that you don't know about radiation. Doctor, I need your help, but he seemed to uh, help me out for free. I better go now. So that's not a problem, but we need to get. Uh, can I get a small discount? No, it's not gonna work. I need your help. I need to buy this thing. I, I have to. I have to buy that. There's just no way around it. What is this? So that's just a healing thingy. Rubles. I don't have a lot of stuff to really put in. Well, I'm, I'm over encumbered right now. But we can always sell our stuff later. So I think I'm just gonna go with rubles now, rupees, and trade. Then I'm gonna use that syringe. This game is hardcore. Uh, on ourselves. To get rid of the radiation. Then I also gotta make sure that we're not starving to death. But also we can't find the food. Uh, that that should have it. That should do it. I think. <clears throat> and... Uh, I want to check out the crafting, so we can experiment with stuff. What's a round? So I can make some bullets. Uh, so I need five waste paper. Equipment, click away from that. So how many waste paper I got? I can't can't search for it. But the book receipt. Seems like I have none. Oh my god, game, what are you doing? Seems like I have no waste paper. I have 
five, actually, never mind that. We have five. And that's the recipe. And that's the amount of components I got. Okay, finally. It's it's clear now. Shot round. That's a shotgun round. So this is a shotgun bullet. And this is just a regular bullet. However, I'm not sure what it goes well with. Uh, apparently, I have uh, the c capability to make one bolt. I don't have the capability to make a crossbow. Or a bag. Or a DI we respirator. We don't need that. A zip gun. Isn't that like a really bad gun? Uh, don't I? I don't know, man. Pipe rifle. So, either one works. So, I can make a pipe rifle. I guess. It should work. Chance is low. But what chance is that? Chance of what? Game. Broken bottle. Great. Shrichanka. Custom made grenade. And a ship. So what about the pipe rifle? What if I make that? Oh, I get it now. So, the chance of you making it. Because if you have a, a low chance... And you can't make it, so I need to. I would need to uh, actually level up my my crafting skill to make it more likely that I actually make it. But what if I try to make uh, like a bullet, like a round, like that? Fail, fail. Zip gun round. And, and this is also for the zip gun. Uh, not anything else that I actually have. Because I would have to make the zip gun first. Oh my god, game. What is this? So. Uh, crafting is basically useless for us. But not really sure what to do. We're not suffering from radiation. I think the best course of action at this point. Is to leave down. Uh, take the revolver and shoot our brains out. No, I was just, I was just kidding about the last part. Uh, we have to uh, look for some shoppers, uh, sh shop coys, and try to get some better gear or get some companions. That would be great. Hopefully, melee companions, because I, even I can't use use guns. This is not gonna work. I would need to go this way. Yeah. Next stop is the drunken lair. Damn. Where the fuck do I go type of game? Oh boy. So, thanks for watching guys and see you next time.